What's up, people? Another hunt video. Kaya's with me. She's rocking all her new uh, Christmas outfit. For some reason, Kaya has like $500. She went to see her grandparents and then got money sent in the mail from her grandparents. Now she's got more money than me. Uh, you gonna buy me lunch today? Um. Well, Kaya's got 500 bucks, so she wants to go to the mall. And uh, I'm off work this week. She's off school, so we're gonna go to the mall. But we're starting at, because it's a hunt video, of course, we're gonna start at Walmart. Uh, this is different Walmart than we've been going to to see if they got anything on the shelves. And I, I need a picture frame, actually. So we're really at Walmart. Then we're going to eat lunch. Then we're going to the mall. Uh, remember, if you have not watched the new health challenge for 2022 or seen my interview on Seth's channel on MCE or anything in the last week, check it out. Hashtag B-Dub-Fit. B-E-D-U-B-F-I-T. And join us on our 2022 health challenge. The speaker's always so loud. And uh, you can win prizes every month. Maybe something we buy today, because that's why we're doing hunt videos now. Anyway, B-Dub Fit, let's do it. Kai, are you going to join the health challenge? Um, I'm sure I'll try. Are you going to do kickboxing with me? Yeah, that's what I thought. Let's see some toys. They're restocking. I was going to say, I bet the shelves are nearly empty, but they're actively restocking as we speak. Those are empty. I've already walked by, so here we go. Oh, there's a lot of people on this aisle. Gauntlet. Why well, they got the music so loud in Walmart right now? Scout Trooper and Wasp. Oh, Ooh. There's a lot of chaos in this aisle. It looks like it's clearing up. We got Eternals, Cersei, Halo. Wow. There's a lot of Battle Cat and Battle Cat and Battle Cat. John Cena, Skellige. I mean, this section right here is pretty stocked. I mean, nothing anybody probably needs. You probably all have all this if you need it. AEW, AEW. Hearing cross, not the oh, I even have an ultimate in the house. Ric Flair, guys, run away. I don't know where she's going. Going to look at Lego. You can go wherever you want, wherever you want. Let's see, Alien. Now, this area is just wiped out. That's the Pokemon area. Alien. Oh, here's a mini faces of Pennywise. That's a thing that could be on a giveaway here at some point. There's the toot gun. You're gonna, in honor oh, it's of the mother. farts and laughs blaster. Is that the same one or is that different? I think this one's... Oh, hang on. Yeah, see, this one's it's different. It's, Farts and laughs. So, you pull it back in it. Oh, and it sticks to... Well, don't make a poop. No, that's, that's not fun. Wait, nope. hang on. No, it's said this should have sound. Well, hang on. not oh. enough flatulence. Hang on. See? No, no. Now you got to... Oh. There we go. Oh, goodness. <laughs> you need to do both at the same time? You better say safety. <laughs> oh. Let's see, three and three quarters stuff. Kai's favorite, the Emperor. No. Trevor. I mean, it, this is not the most product they've ever had, but it is certainly not empty. Ajax, some multiverse, armored Batman, Aquaman, King Shazam. The Eternals wave is just intermittently scattered throughout this whole place. Three and three quarter legends of various nature. His tank, a lot of Joes. Over Commander. I don't know, those things going to be clearance out. I bet at some point Walmart's going to clearance some things out. Okay. Well, I don't think there's anything here we want. Batman TV? Yes, I... Oh. Oh, wait. I'm actually here for a frame. Let me go get my frame. I was eyeballing the video games, even though she just got a million. Hmm. Find one if you want it. It's your money. Found my shelf. Uh, <laughs> shelf? Good job, Ryan. I found my uh, frame. G.I. Joe Pops... There's a Bakugo down there. Annabelle, Billie Eilish. Huh. Avengers themed neck of things. Sauron. Oh, I've never seen that. Clear Eyes, Goku. Many faces of Pennywise again. Five Nights at Freddy Advent Calendar. Boy, those Xbox games have been torn up. Gingerbread Scarlet Witch. All right, I got a TT. I'm going to take her to launch. Jerry with Pez. I got to buy this and see if she's going to buy. Are you going to buy anything at Walmart? Are you going to buy me the Simpsons arcade game now? It's not here. If we find it, you'll buy it for me? It's $500. Oh! Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Maybe that's it. That's, that's Is Leatherface the villain in Texas Chainsaw Massacre? 
I don't remember. Because I'm pretty sure Candyman, the literal villain, is Candyman. Candy I have a monster. I wanted to tell you, I, when I went to TT, we all I bought was the monster and the picture frame, kiting anything. I went to TT, oh, no. and there was a uh, gentleman at the sink. And you know how, like, sometimes, you probably had to do this, too. You're at a sink and a mirror in a public restroom, and you notice, like... Maybe some makeup's messed up or like something's wrong with your hair and you're using like water to try to, you know, like if my hair is sticking up, you know, you like water and you try to mat it down, whatever the case may be, like some sort of touch up, yeah, right? Absolutely. You're not happy with something. So this gentleman was doing that, right? I, I, I kind of out of my peripheral because I'm PP and I'm trying not to pay attention to the man. I'm semi-nude, you know, in the bathroom. And uh, I noticed out of my periphery that something weird's happening. And I try to be observant, right? Especially in public. Now people are crazy. She's like, what is this person doing over there? And I see, and he's like, water in his den. I'm like, oh, okay, he's fixing his hair. Well, and I look over, and the gentleman's bald. <laughs> and he was wearing, like, a newspaper boy style, like, Friday cap. Nice. And the, all this was on the hat. <laughs> there was no hair to try to adjust he just kept like dabbing it and getting paid. So I either, A, I don't know what was going on or somehow he got like Dijon mustard on his hat and he was trying to get it off. Yeah, I would think like there was something on the hat and he was trying to get it off. Maybe, maybe, but maybe. But why wouldn't he take what off happened, the What happened, but right, right. Why did he leave it on his head? Maybe what happened is before I got in there to pee pee, maybe this gentleman had some um, intestinal distress, shall we say, and he was on the potty, and he took his hat off and put it on the ground for some reason, and a little bit spilled out. Think that's what happened? Oh, that's... that's. We're gonna go to lunch. You excited now? Thinking that story for lunch? No. Yay! I'm excited for wherever we're going to lunch, because oh, I don't know. Crystals. What? We're here at Pow Pow for almond and dumplings, but look at this. That didn't used to be there, did it? Cotton candy vending machine. Huh. We've had our gyoza and our boba tea arrive. Delicious. Delicious. You're jealous of yourself right now? We have food. A little bento box. A little bit of everything. Just a little tiny bit of everything. All right, we're gonna eat, and then Kyle wants to get a cotton candy. I know this is a hunt episode, so this little bit feels like double life, but there's a cotton candy vending machine. Yeah. We have to do it, we have to, we have to. All right, bento time. Now we're going in from a cotton candy. Guardian of the Heart, Blue Elf. You want a mini one? Warm Jacket, Blue Elf, or do you want one of these? Those ones are pretty, but I'm very cold, so I don't know. I knew you had to take a dump. So which one do you want? Dreams come true. I think either this one or the one of these two. Orchid love, guardian of the heart of blue elf. Yeah. Orchid love. That's what we're gonna do. Variety, soft and sweet. Okay, gotta pay for it. Here it goes. Uh oh. Let's see. Look at that. Oh, where's it going? Going up high. Oh, it's like making it in the Oh, that's kind of true. Oh, that looks naughty. Don't copyright me with the cotton candy music. Don't copyright me with the cotton candy music. Are you excited for this? I'm very excited for this. I have never in my life seen cotton candy the vending machine. I've only ever seen like, oh, videos of people doing this. Huh. Crazy. Are you going to go ham on this cotton candy? Maybe. You're going to dip it in ham? No. Probably not. What a thing this is. Oh, going up high. Going up high. Oh, 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 it's, oh shaking it's shaking it. Like it's shaking it for us. It's making it down. Oh. Oh, it's making the flower shape. Oh. That's quite a piece of technology, really. Please take the sugar when the light is on. Huh. What a thing. Oh, has it got a side window? Oh. Wow. Huh. Are you going to trance by it now? Is it like hypnotizing you? 
Oh my goodness. Oh, it's gonna put it in a hole. It's gonna put it in a hole. Please take the sugar when the light is on. Let's see. Oh, the light is on. Oh. Yeah, whip that thing out. Show it to us. Don't break it. It's hot. No, it's just made. Wow. Oh, it's a heart flower situation. I think it's a Hold it aloft like Zelda, like Link. Yes. This is so cool. That's quite a thing. If you're interested in this type of weird thing, that's the type of stuff we usually do on Dub Life, but I've never seen that thing before. We come to this restaurant quite a bit, and they never had that, so we had to do it. I know it's a hunt video, but a little, little Dub Life for you. Kai's got a massive thing of cotton. Oh, good. Let's see if it's good. Yeah, cotton candy. To the mall we go. How's your cotton candy? Good. It's quite a thing. A seven fifty. At the fair, we'd probably pay what, like five bucks for that. That was worth it. Though. That's cool. That's cool to see. So we're at the Mall of Georgia. We're gonna go into Mon Mar, which, as Victoria, Natalie, and Kaya say, is the preferred pooper. It's the best bathroom. I don't think anybody has to poop yet, at least. Uh, but we're at the mall. We're gonna hit up. Uh, let's see. At least four stores. Hot Topic. Uh, oh, probably five stores. Hot Topic box lunch. Think Geek if it's still open. GameStop. And then uh, Character World, the kind of anime store. It also has Hot Toys. And that'll be it for this hunt video. And really, it's just for Kai. See if she wants anything. There could be something I could be tempted into. You never know. You almost ran right into that pillar, and that would have been calamity. But I didn't. She did. She did. I don't know what I just said. Whoop. Well, it looks like Think Geek is finally gone. Because he was either right here. I think it was this, where the B12 store was. I believe that was the Think Geek. Fare thee well, Think Geek. That makes me sad a little bit. She's just balled it up. She's not eating like candy out. Although, uh, that Think Geek was on his last legs for a long time. Since GameStop basically closed, shuttered Think Geek when they bought it. It was hanging on for dear life, and like the last time we were in there, you could buy like the things that hung the t-shirts, all kind of weird stuff, but they kept claiming they weren't closing, but they were closing. It was obvious. I asked her if she wanted to film Kid Double Life today, but she said no. I didn't want to get more people motion sickness. Dipping it. Man, Christmas just done it. That used to be the Disney store just a few weeks ago. It's gone too. Box Lunch is still here, though. You excited for Box Lunch? Yeah. That's sad. Disney Store and Think Geek both closed in just a few weeks. Well, here we go. Hunting it up. Let's see what we got. Do you know what that anime is? I don't know what that is. I is think that's is that a... That's not a Sailor Moon person? It's Inuasha. Inuasha. It's my hero. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. That. Planet Vegeta. You like this Goku staring at Frieza? Sailor Pluto. Sixty-five ninety. Sailor Saturn. Y'all just got that for Christmas. Where the rings. Don't copyright me. I feel like that's some stuff. Natalie may want. Let's see. Soldier Supreme. Seven ninety nine. Idris Elba, Suicide Squad, Jack McFarlane, Billy Madison, Glassware, oh, old X Men. Ooh, that flatulent smells poor. My goodness, was that me? Did I say safety? I don't even remember. Dumbo. Let's look at the Funko. See if there's any Avatar or Sailor Moon, Ghost Panther. I don't know what that is. Rex. A whole bunch of the Scooby Doo. And Winnie the Pooh reading with like his nightcap on. Like All right, I don't think there's anything I'm interested in here, but I'm gonna let the kiddo shop around, see if there's anything she wants, and then we'll be on to the next one. I did get a pin from what, Seven Deadly Sons? King? Uh, and that's it. And now, that's a, what's that line for? Oh, Cinnabon. We're gonna go in GameStop, see what they got. GameStop time, you're gonna get that pink Power Ranger helmet. Dark Star podcast. Yeah. There's the Pink Ranger helmet. It's actually kind of nice. Wheel. 
blue sticker. I don't know what the blue sticker means. More dark stuff. I think they said these are on sale on GameStop online for like 15 bucks. Yes? Yes. I hope it is. Not a lot of figures in here. Let's see. Lawful Amiibo. Snake Face. Leatherneck. Snake Face. Zombie Captain America. I think I saw there might be hot toys of that coming. All the zombie what ifs. That'd be quite a thing. Joker. That's it. That's all the figures and stuff in here, I think, right? There's some amiibo over there. I was going to look at the video games. I don't want to show you in the hunt so far this week, but that's all right. We'll uh, see if she's going to pick something up and move on to Hot Top. That's the pen that Kaya got at Box Lunch. She's getting this Mimikyu shirt and some Switch Bucks because you're going to buy... Uh, Spirit, the horsey game? No. What are you going to buy with these Switch Box? I'm going to buy um, Ace Attorney games. Oh, not Spirit, the horsey games? No. No. On to the next one. Are you going to buy some uh, uh, jerseys? Um, probably not. No? Braves jerseys? No. The 2021 World Series Champ? Oh, you want to go to Hot Topic, don't you? Uh-oh, clearance sale, $6 t-shirts. I'll buy one, get one 30% off. You gotta get a double. Oh, look at that Venom shirt right there. That's an Iron Maiden Venom collaboration. Huh. Stranger Ulala? This is how you spend all your money with Horsehead Boy. Look at all this My Hero stuff from the movie. That's a lot of it. Oh, safety. I don't know there's gonna be a lot of toys. Oh, Brittany. The ramen place giving me gas. It's a lot of pops. Not many on the shelf. In fact, the shelves you can reach practically empty. Zombie alpaca, but up there are the ones you can't reach. There are a few. I don't know that those are anything anybody wants. Oh, package. It's not been the most productive hunt for you all, but Kai's having a good time, which is more important. Time. She got several jewelry, earrings, and a, earrings bow. and a bow. Don't uh, look at the camera and accidentally trip and fall all the way down the escalator down there. That would be disaster. And probably cause a little poop to come out. That'd be my guess. You want to show them what you got? Sure. This is a hot topic. There's been very few action figures on any of these shelves. So, um, this bow. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Oh. Okay. I thought it was a butt. Keep walking. I can do this for walking. Hi. We're about to find out. <laughs> she claims these, um, she has trouble walking earrings. while walking. Normally. They have, a, like, Flower the same earrings. Flower earrings. But with different colors so I can match them to my outfit. Yep, that's good. Match them to your kicks as well. Yeah, that's the way it is. What else? Maybe that's it. Package, huh? And these like star earrings. Star earrings. Star earrings, flower earrings, strawberry bow. We already had bubble tea. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we don't need to get that bubble tea. We're going to go to Character World now. Character World. That's where she's going to spend her money. You going to buy a hot toy with your $500? Um, I, I hot toys! I'm on this side now. She's on that side. We've had a couple off camera adventures. Kaya got some bath and body works, yeah. candles and whatever. And we stopped by Lush and they had a sale. And I've never, ever, once seen a sale in Lush. No. Never. And I've been buying stuff for ladies at Lush for many years. And never once has there been a sale. Lush is a cosmetics and like bath product store. It's not a cheap store where you can buy bath bombs yes. for the ooh la la. Not for her, not for her regular baths and that kind of thing uh and they had a sale where all their christmas type stuff was half price but it's still just like bubble bath even though it looks like santa claus so yeah. i got seven things i got natalie more than seven things so that happened off camera but now finally our final stop of the episode character world get this symbiote spider-man or big big deadpool those are cool, but they're probably like a thousand It's not for you? No. What about this Pennywise? Uh, no. Or this Batgirl? Or Weapon X, Spider-Man, Loki, Joker, none of that? The giraffe, maybe? The giraffe. Oh. Let's see what we got. We have the variant Bring Arts, which are similar to that fighting armor I'm getting from Sentinel, but I've seen really poor reviews on those. Although that Thor right there does tempt me. 
Nendoroids, and then these are the new figure arts, the Avengers ones. Oh, Kung Lao down there. Storm Collectibles Kung Lao. Old Thor Ragnarok figure arts. Uh, that's a really loud noise uh, above me from the air, so I'm sorry if it's too loud. Got some Dragon Ball stuff. Chi Chi, Tao Pai Pai, Lunch, Mr. Satan, that new Goku Black, Ultraman, Imagination Works, Evangelion, what are these? Figure Arts Mini, Super Sailor Pluto. I don't know if Natalie has that one or not. Yeah, look at the list. Edward Elric from Full Metal Alchemist. Those Buzz Mod figures I've never seen out of the package. Up there are some Q Poskets and some Van Presto. Back there, look at that. Uh, that's a sideshow, quarter scale maybe? Mandalorian and Child. We'll go over there in a minute. Check out some Pops. Evil Lynn, Master of the Universe Pops. The Samurai Jack. I don't know a lot of these things that are up there. I don't know a lot of them. What's over here? That's just random tchotchkes and what have you. And then just animals. Big lion. Some Pokemon stuff under there. Dark Sylveon Mewtwo trainer kit. Yeah, and this premium format Mandalorian. Got some Vegeta trun or trunks over there. Loki. I don't know what that is. Iron Spider ring arts that's just like not in the box, looks like. I don't know about that. Loki, Leatherface, Code of Bakia, a Voltron. Oh, that's a Death Watch Mando hot toy. No, I don't think there's anything here I'm gonna pick up. Let me find a kiddo. Where is she? She's over there looking at knickknacks. There is this here that I know Natalie doesn't have. A big old life-size proplica of the moon kaleidoscope. Do not know if she'd like it. These are in stock on Big Bad Toy Store on Amazon at 180, which I'm guessing is the retail price. Stores like this often have stuff way more expensive than the retail price, but I think I may ask about it. I told a fib. Thought we were done. We're done with the mall. Oh, we're going to Best Buy. And then Target. Because she needs things from Best Buy and Target, apparently. Spending all your money. Did you get anything at the anime store? Uh, yes, I got a pen, a pencil, and a, a, a drink. drink. Uh, the Proplica was way overpriced. I mean, almost double the price. That is clearly available on Amazon and Big Bad Toy Store. But that's what that store does. They overcharge out the behind. I mean, really, the only time I ever buy figures or anything there is if they have something that they started off overpriced. But then it's been like two years because nobody bought it because of how overpriced it was. And then the secondary market is even higher than that. Then it's a decent price, I guess. Very rarely do we actually buy stuff in there, but it's cool to look at. Best Buy time. Kai just went immediately to the Switch games. I think I've just shown this in a recent hunt. It doesn't look like anything's different. Tigra, Sprite, Armored Batman, the Demon. Yeah, we were here not long ago. Predator, Halloween. Don't copyright me, Hydra Stomper. Those garbage figures that if they ever got down to super clearance, I might would buy. All right, there ain't no toys in here we want. Look over here and look at the Lego, which has almost been completely obliterated and empty. No Pokemon anymore. Doesn't look like any arcade one-ups. That's where they usually are. Huh. Best Buy has been thrashed. You can buy old steel books to video games that have been out for a long time, though, if you're interested in that. Um, like, what's this? It's a Dirk Nowitzki steel book. But just the steel book. Um, what? That's the part of the game she bought her Switch things for. A couple of them. She wants the whole kit and caboodle. Switch games. Well, a short lived uh, hunt in Best Buy. Next stop, Target. Oh, we've advanced to Target after the. Very quick and unproductive Best Buy stuff. What are you here for? Oh, makeup. makeup. She's here for makeup. We'll skip that part on, since it's a hunt video, but we will. Uh, this is whoop. a very productive hunt video. You know, uh, are y'all enjoying this hunt video? I know this has not been the most traditional. Uh, very much like the other crap on my channel, though. <laughs> dub Life and Kid <laughs> Dub Life, which she didn't want to film, even though it's just kind of become Kid Dub Life, but me doing it. Instead of you. That's not fair. Are you going to give me the camera now? So it's gonna no, uh-uh. I done worked hard on this. Absolutely not. 
I am, uh, I'm, we may have already gone past them. I think we have. We're going to the NECA Funko section first. We're going to go out of order. NECA Funko first. Mmm, that's living dangerously. You think there's going to be some Ninja Turtles here? April mm -hmm. O'Neil set. Catwoman from Channel 6. Isn't that an exclusive? It was a Target exclusive, but then there was a, uh, they sold it through Comic-Con first. But then, uh, the thing that came with, like, the extra stuff, I think. T-shirts and that, that was the exclusive part. Figures you can get here. Never seen them. Never seen anybody seen them, but we'll find out. Take feet. This is the place we were at the last hunt video that had one million. Yep, they still do. All of these frogs and mutants that nobody wants to buy, even after Christmas. All of those. A lot of stuff in the NECA section. A lot of stuff. And then that, the old man figure. Wouldn't be a bad figure to get to get the leg lamp. It's back there. I don't know what that is. Muck Everlasting. Predator. Man, it's just loaded, but there's nobody buying any of this stuff. Tell me, in y'all's NECA sections, especially Target NECA sections, they look like this. Maybe they don't have the turtles, but they're starting to. Um, does it still look like this? Ours looks like this frequently, and it's like nobody buys these horror figures. Like, they just don't get bought. And I'm wondering how much longer Target's going to keep NECA stuff, but maybe they sell and they just get restocked over and over again. I don't know. But it feels like they're just always here forever and ever. See more of the turtles. Mean more of the turtles' mutants all over the place. There's Splinter, Black Widow. Oh, that's the new, uh, the Joker. Look at all those Jokers. That's the new one, though. I wonder if they have the Batman like that. Just one million Jokers. Some more Splinters. Tandra model kit. I got some model kits for Christmas. Build those at some point. Midoriya statue. Midoriya model kit. I want those to go on half price. This guy I have almost bought several times for no good reason. The Batcave place that other than it's like, oh, that's cool, nostalgia. I don't need to buy it. Ralphie and the old man. Batgirl. Well, at least we're getting to look at some things this time. As opposed to most of this hunt, even though I don't think any of this is going to be purchased. I've got some things already for the next giveaway, for the first giveaway in January. Which, if you want to be entered in the giveaway all month long in January on Instagram. Instagram is month one where the giveaway will happen. Uh, use the hashtag B-Dub-Fit. B-E-D-U-B-F-I-T. And you have to post something that's related to improving your life in 2022. So, going to the gym, eating better. I haven't smoked in three days. A picture of a good healthy meal. Whatever. I don't care what it is. But, like, when we select the winner, it can't be, like, you at Walmart buying toys like that can't be that it has to be related to the health and fitness challenge so use it at the end of january there'll be a giveaway and the way it's going to work on my side i can't tell you what seth's going to do he'll tell you himself but i'll just have a, few, a variety of things and you can pick one and i'll mail it to you no cost to you ship it to you get it to you safe and sound uh, and you can just pick one of the items that's in the giveaway uh, and everybody will get to see what was in the giveaway so they can know for the next month uh, you don't even got to be subscribed to me you ain't got to follow me nothing just participate. I am more concerned about helping you out and thus encouraging you to use the hashtag, which means you're doing something healthy, making good choice than I am about. Now, it'd be great if you'll subscribe to me, follow me, all that stuff. That'd be wonderful, um, but not necessary. All you gotta do is use the hashtag and the picture that you post is uh, something related to it because that'll help encourage me too. If I see people using that grow and grow, I'll work harder, I'll work harder. I did not. What's this WandaVision? It's a Quicksilver shirt, isn't it? I don't want that. All right, let's go to the figure out. With the Lego aisle, which is pretty wiped out. I mean, it's actually very, very wiped out. Not a lot of restock. I want that thing. I want them to give me that display thing. I think that's cool with the Harry Potter chef. Uh, I guess those are not popular Christmas items, nor is the Eternal stuff. Uh, even though I think that would be kind of a cool Lego set to build, as do I think that ship would be. Guardian ship. Yeah, Eternal stuff. Not terribly popular. Uh, let's see. Figure aisle in it. Figure aisle in it. Seth likes the Lots of the flower bouquet, though, which for a long time was a very hard Lego set to find and sold on the aftermarket. Too expensive. There's some more Lego. That's a good one. The bookshop. 
We have that one. We don't have that one, though I would like it. The Medieval Blacksmith. I do not think that's 119. I think it is more expensive than that. That's a cool set. Oh, Purple Passion. All right, let's go to the figure out. What are you doing? Looking at the Blacksmith? That's a cool set. I'm trying to see where it How much it is. Let's see, Multiverse. That's the Movie Flash. There's the Clown. Oh, we're the the clown. Three Jokers wave. That version of Joker. The comedian and the uh, criminal, right? Yep. Batgirl. Is that Burnside Batgirl? Just three Jokers Batgirl. But they don't seem to have any of the other. It's the first time I've seen that in person. I had the uh, what is it? The comedian, the clown. What's the other one? And the criminal. The criminal. The criminal. I think is the killing joke one which we had as GameStop exclusive and we sold on whatnot at a great price. I think we sold that for like 13 or 14 bucks. Megatron, the same GI Joe and Power Rangers that are here always until the end of time. A whole bunch of Marvel Legends though. I mean a whole bunch of Marvel Legends. This is the same that was here before though. A million rogues, Magneto. There's a whole bunch of these Cyclops if I remember, yeah. Mobius, some some ball in a sack. Oh, it changes colors. Huh. What is that again? See that? It's a... Um... Nah. Oh, look, it's like nah. rainbow. All set there. Mr. Fantastic, it's a rainbow. See, it can be green here. Nope. Mm -mm. Vulture. Man, well, if you want those legends, that's where those are. Let's see. Sounds like a child's got uh, uh, emphysema. <laughs> There's the... Grand Studios. Look at that biggie. Top picks. I don't think I've seen that style card before. Britt Baker seems to be sitting the way that Rio did. Who is that back there? Selena Vega. Billy God Ray Ripley. Nothing worthwhile there. A whole bunch of faker that's been on sale forever. Oh, it's on sale right now, isn't it? I mean, that's a good price. Half price. Faker for $16.50. I even already have more than one of these, but I think that figure's cool. I have it with the all like cyborg robot head on him, but I think that head's cool and like the evil He Man head. Huh. 1650, I'd almost buy another. I wish that Battle Cat was like that. Oh, yeah, that one's 1250. I wish that was half price. I've thought about having another one of them as Cringer. Hmm. I already have an extra one of each of those. Beast Man, Evil Man. I think I've got the Panther Skeletor. one. Yeah, that's for the other line, but yeah. That's the one that goes with these guys. The kind of retro ones. Panther. I hope they make a Panther, because in the second part of the show, uh, Skeletor Red Road Panther. So I think they'll make it. Mirrorverse guys. Tiny Toot. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Jack Sparrow. What else is in there? Mickey and like Goofy. And then Jurassic World. I mean, this Target is decently stocked uh, for a lot of stuff. John Hammond. Okay, I guess we gotta go to the makeup section. To the makeup section. Am I gonna buy this faker? That could be a good thing to give away. Eh, maybe. Let me know in the comments if that'd be an interested prize for a giveaway. Do, you want the uh, do I want the what? The pooping dog. Let me see it. The pooping dog? See, it has, it has poop. Oh, it's poop a lot. <laughs> if you pull the thing, it takes a dump? I poop. Oh, Kaka. Hey, Kaya. Yeah? What do you reckon happened there? To that He-Man. The same thing that I was just looking at over here to this wall. Well, I think it's time to dip. Well, I think that wraps us up. After the, uh, whatever that was, on poor He-Man, and on the wall, look how pretty the sky is. Sun's going down. Can you see it? Let's see. It's kind of pretty. But that wraps up another hunt video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let's not get hit by that gray vehicle. Uh, did you enjoy your hunt video? Yeah. I know you did. She bought all kinds of stuff. I didn't buy a single thing, I don't think. She bought all kinds of stuff. You bought a bath bomb. I did buy bath bombs for mom. That's true. Nothing on camera. Uh, but tune in to dub life on sunday tune in to uh future hunt video next week maybe or the week after a kid dub life episode probably six months away because 
like she feels bad that she made people motion sick and now she's weeping in her bedroom because people weeping. left comments that said it made me sick and now she's crying and weeping I'm not. every night. I heard her. She's weeping. <laughs> Alright, well, what should they do until the next video? Uh, squeeze it. Was that what happened to the white? No, squeeze it.